And welcome back to Minecraft episode 71. In the last episode, I got myself out of my predicament, and which was me stuck in a hole. I got myself out of the hole and made my way back to the house here. And I gathered a little bit more iron, I think eight blocks. Oh no, I'm at 20, that was eight that I found, plus I had 16 on me. And I got some more wood, because wood is good. If ever there was such a play on words, that would be the one I would use. But, at any rate, what I am doing right now is making the... building up the land here for the deck that I am putting on this place. And also, the patio. And I'm going to need to make some half steps for that. So, let's craft us some half steps. I don't know how many I'm going to need yet, but it's, uh, I should probably make quite a few so that I have them. We'll start with 63 and work from there. However, I may have to, uh, <coughs> postpone the first floor building and just concentrate on the second floor building because nighttime is coming and that means <coughs> sorry more phlegm nighttime is coming and that means mobs and danger now I can still keep working on the house I'll do it as long as I can here because <coughs> yeah I think I'll make this wrap all the way around the house that would look pretty cool right and I'm still good on wood for the most part this is going to wrap around to here, and then the half steps take over, and they're going to make this stone patio. And I am going to make it go too high, meaning two half steps high. <coughs> and, see, is that, oh, okay, I was just going to make it to here, so let me quick chip these away gonna make it on half the house because the patio doesn't have to be huge and then I can make a back door and in that basement I can make an underground access point to the dock also I know it's getting really dark now I want to try to get this patio done at least before the mobs start to raid and then I can work on the second floor while they're busy trying to kill me <laughs> as the flim continues to mount. It looks like my tree didn't grow, so that's good. As long as I don't put too much light near it, it'll be okay. Let's see what I got in this chest, huh? <coughs> More dirt. That's good. Technically, I don't need it right now, so I'll put that away. Uh, let's see. Oh, i tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to smelt the rest of this iron that I have. And I've got more sand. That's going to be windows. And let me organize a little bit here. i tell you what also I have to make is uh, for these, not too many more. Oh, use the crafting table dummy. I don't have to make too many more, but I'd like maybe 25, maybe 30 fences for the construction of the decks and all that stuff. Because the fences, I mean, yeah, there's only one style or whatever, but they look nice. <clears throat> I like them. And I can make one more. So 32. That works. Let me throw down the feathers. I don't want to, if I happen to go outside and take a chance, I don't want to have to deal with anything uh, and, and losing, even though I know that the spawn is right near here. But, yeah, 18 saplings, that, that's plenty. Okay, who's outside? Who came to the party today? You gotta go, and that. Alright, I see cows. Cows aren't hostile per se, but you never know. How about out here? Maybe I should put the porch lights. Here we go. 
Now, this is a good vantage point for picking off mobs, huh? Alright. I don't see any, though. Well, there's a few out there. Oh, there's a zombie sitting out there. I don't know if you can see him. But he's just kind of running around. Now I see... thought I saw a creeper. Maybe I'm just imagining things. But, whatever. Right now, I'm going to finish this deck area. I need to go out one more space without falling. <laughs> I know I have crouching, I'm just not so used to it yet. Alright. Yeah, I think this will make the house look really nice. When you put these, these decks, because uh, it's the same principle as the overhangs that you find when you're running around the map. You find these huge arms of, of ground that are, you know, impossible structures. Uh, there is Creeper. Alright. <clears throat> you know, they, they really look neat. And at the same time, they, uh, oh, you want some of this action, don't you? I think, basically what I'm saying is I think this house is going to produce the same effect. If you have gun, if you drop gunpowder, nothing. Nothing! How many creepers is that? Somebody's got to go back and look at all my videos and see how many creepers I have killed so far and that have not yielded gunpowder. It's unbelievable. I just like TNT, man. Who doesn't? <laughs> it's not making sense to me. But whatever. I like this idea of the deck wrapping around the house completely, too. Because like I said, I, I like making homes that look somewhat realistic. But at the same time, they also have to be able to function in a Minecraft world. That's the difference. So, maybe there's houses out there where you have decks that go all the way around the house. Multi-level decks and stuff like that. But I'm just trying to make this usable. And I want it to look nice. And what we're doing here is the last of these deck parts. Okay. There's a spider. Whack. <laughs> yeah, I'm a probably, uh, you know, bragging a little. Oh, there's two spiders. Well, they're just gonna get taken out. That one's in the water now. That one's dead. And this one's dead. Huh, now I'm missing. Can't use too many arrows on those guys because... Yeah. I wonder if he drops string though. I do need to make a fishing pole. Just cause it's there, you know? But, whatever. Where was I? Oh yes. Now I'm gonna make this safe by putting these here. Ooh. Now I'm also wondering if I can fire on things through the fences or if because it's a block. Wow, I actually ran out. I gotta use a lot of fences, man. A lot of fences. Let's see who's outside, nobody? I really want to go and see what happened to those spiders, though. Uh, well. Maybe. Now, see, my armor's still okay. Alright, well, I tell you what we'll do. Let's go see. Ah, oh, crap. Don't even think about it, skeleton. As soon as I say, let's go see, they come calling. But not today. Zombie. Creeper. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, lucky me. Get your feathers. Yeah, this is a bad idea. But I must know what happened to the spiders. They did drop string. How do you like that? Now, my question is... See, I don't know how to make this thing. Is it two string and three sticks? Or two sticks and three string? I can't... I never looked up the, the recipe for... For the... Fishing rod, so I don't know. But, I'm gonna try a couple of things and see what we get. Let's first try 
three sticks. I know it's something like this, and then this. Oh, there it is! <laughs> there you go, there's a fishing rod. But, as uh, we know from, from people that have uh, already tried this, <coughs> The fishing rod does not work. At least, I don't know that it does because I haven't, uh, this is the first one I've ever made. And I don't know, like, I mean, obviously it's got to be in water or something like that. But, yeah, it doesn't seem like it does anything. You can't click or anything like that. No fish yet, so. Okay, so cool. We got a fishing rod totally useless like half the other items in the game that have been made in the last uh, month or so but well what are you gonna do right still burning this glass alright so the fishing rod you're gonna have to go in there right now and let's see what else well I have to make more fences because I ran out up there so let's put these sticks down And let's finish that job. Because I want to make fence on the lower level too, but not all the way around. Just in in key parts so that the mobs are not as are not as able to uh, get on there. Like if I have fences that are you know uh, well, you'll see what I mean. It's hard to explain when I'm Still processing it, but at any rate, here we go. Let me just do a spot check quick to make sure I'm not going to get surprised. All right, I'm not. I need more wood for this side, but basically, what I'm thinking is, and now if anyone is wondering, you're going to learn how to, uh, you're going to learn how to make fence posts. It might be common knowledge at this point, but not everybody knows. Not everybody's as tech savvy and get the info the second it happens. Basically, I gotta build these downward. So the first one goes here. Get rid of this dirt. That goes there. Get rid of this. That goes there. And there we have it. And the same thing goes over here. Put these. Put a fence. Get rid of the block. Put a fence. Get rid of the block. Put a fence. And then that goes like that. And this is a great sniping spot right here because if I put uh, actually this should have been a half step down but if I put a uh, half step block I can build this fence downward so that it's it's fenced off from enemies you know and I think I'm gonna close off this part of the deck too at this part Oops. And I do want to make a, a stairway with an entrance down to this pool so I can do sand mining. So I'm going to leave that open and put my dirt and that goes there. Oh, you know what? That's wrong. Because I didn't extend this part out yet. It's over here that I want to do it. So this has to go real quick. And then right before this episode ends, I'll step back and, and look at it so far. There we go. And then another one right here. And one more. Looks like it's, it's down there. Jump down there and get it. Come back up. Put it there. Alright, now let's take a look at what I've done so far. From a distance. There's mobs everywhere. All right. Now that's starting to look interesting. Let me get it from another angle here. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. <clears throat> it gives the house a real uh, widening sensation. Hey, chicken. Oh, yeah, feather. I like that. So the house is coming along nicely. I'm... I'm building it at the same time as I'm setting up uh, the uh, the different areas I want to do. I'm going to do a sand mine here. The other way is going to be a gravel mine. 
and we'll do that in the next episode.